guys, how's it going? My name is Auntie Titi. For those of you who don't know me and for those of you who do, I'd like to say welcome back to my channel and thank you for joining me for another way review. reviewing today it's by Ultra in the Melted Hairline collection and it's in the style Amanda I have Amanda in the color DR2 butter pecan buttered pecan and for those of you who don't know a lot about the Melted Hairline collection let me go ahead and read off some of the specs it has baby hairs included it has a pre-attached wide elastic band it is HD transparent lace it is, has a 5 inch deep part. It is completely pre plucked with sideburns. It is designed to fit air to air. Gives a natural finish, 
that melts right into your hairline now that you heard me read off the stock card let's talk about the wig so first off I cut the wig just a tiny bit like right here I didn't like I don't know I didn't like something about it but the good things about the wig it is HD transparent lace it does melt into the hairline very seamlessly it does come in a variety of colors I'm pretty sure the price is under forty dollars if not I'll leave the price down in the description I didn't have time to research it because I wanted to get this video out this week because I've been slacking and I'm supposed to be doing two videos and honey child if I could get one bi-weekly that's a, a lot for me so I'm trying to get more consistent so it has the wig and as a reminder I have in the color DR2 butted pecan um we have already went over what i like about the wig what i don't like about the wig oh before it is big head friendly and it is it is beginner friendly in my opinion um you don't necessarily need to lay it down like i did in my video you could just use the elastic band and the adjustable straps and the combs and it will look natural in my opinion and um what i don't like about the wig the flyaways all tray can i be on your quality team just to check these wigs to make sure they're not so many flyaways and you know what i'm gonna try next time i do an ultra melted hairline wig i won't cut off the air tabs to see if that is what's causing me to have a lot of shedding because on top of the um flyaways i have a lot of shedding from this wig and i'm like what's going on here like what's going on here that's not auntie she don't like that but yeah i'll show you hit your girl up i want to be on your quality team to check these wigs out before you send them out because i could have saved you some coins by mailing me this because i ain't gonna keep it too many flyaways so yeah i'll show you. where can you wear this wig to it's a great work wig if you don't mind the flyaways you can wear this joint every day to work you know it's a great everyday work wig it looks very very natural and um it's very easy to curl it is heat safe up to i'm guessing 300 degrees i don't see it on the stock card but pretty sure that's what it is oh it's heat safe up to 400 degrees not 300 that's what i said i can't remember but yeah it's a very natural looking wig it you know defines the face because it has those soup soup bangs or soupage whatever you want to call them you know what i'm talking about this thing right here <laughs> so yeah i don't have much about this joint because it was i think i spent most of my time trying to get rid of the flyaways like why why and some of the things i used to achieve this look are my even wonder lace adhesive spray red can my got to be glue in the ultra glued invincible styling gel black tube this used to work on my flyaways i don't know what happened so garnier fruity style full control hairspray i did have a knot eraser by perfect line i have their um their green concealer in the color tan so this is what it looks like it looks like scalp right here yeah and yeah, this wig is big head friendly let me tell you big head friendly honey got lots of space under there so yeah that's all i have for you guys today if this is something you enjoyed or if this is something that resonates with you please consider subscribing and also leave down in the comment section how you felt about how i um made this wig look although it looked very much like the stock card I can't figure out what else to do with it because it already came with the curls you know i think titi love has some curls i was gonna try to crimp it up but then i don't think nobody's buying this joint to crimp it up so that's why i didn't do that so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a 360 of this wig probably put it in a ponytail and put some headbands oh yeah you could definitely do that let me see my headband i'll try this joint right here definitely see you could change it up i done messed it up hold up before i
go ahead and give you a 360. Here's the front. Front. There's the side. The back. The other side. And yeah. <laughs> See all the flowers? Mm. I don't know how Entree think this is okay. I don't I don't know. I don't know. If you get to the end of the video, I'd like to say a big old fat thank you to you. You are the real MVP and see you in the next week review. Bye.